In the National League, the Phillies are the last team to integrate. John Kennedy, shortstop with good glove, couldn't hit, lasted two weeks, maybe. Just the kind of a token African-American player to add to the roster. It isn't until Dick Allen comes out of Wampum, Pennsylvania, that they give an African-American player a bonus, a signing bonus. He comes highly recommended. By the time of expansion, by the time the Mets and the Colt 45s come into existence, the Phillies put Allen on the expansion list where the Mets or Houston could have plucked him off the Phillies roster. They called Frank Thomas the donkey for good reason. That was his nickname. And he did and said some really dumb things, including racial things. And that's what started it. There was some needling going on and batting practice on, uh, I think, in July 3rd, maybe. We didn't have a paper the next day, and I wasn't there. Um, words were exchanged. Allen reminded Thomas he had told him not to call him boy, that sort of thing. And the next thing you knew, well, Thomas had a bat in his hand because he was waiting his turn to hit, and Allen had a glove in his hand because he was out in the field. Thomas swung the bat, hit Allen on the shoulder, and the fight started. We pulled apart. Well, the Phillies told Allen they would find him if he told the story of how it happened. And they released Thomas a day and a half later. And the city kind of took sides with Thomas.